What is up, I'm Alex, it's me, Emma Jane, and I'm a Jane TV, and we are here with Jesse. I thought, I just remembered there was another two that I did not cover, and that was Hyanna and Dawn's music videos. So, I might have to look for Hyanna's music video and Dawn's music video and cover them as well, because those are the two I have not heard, I have not seen them, nothing. So, we are going to react to Jessie, I love Jessie, I love me some Jessie, uh, with her song Drip featuring the the beautiful, the, um, the, the man, the grown ass man, Jay Park. <clears throat> this is going to be hella good because I love Jessie and I love Jay Park and those two, yeah, oh yeah, oh I can see sauciness, this paprika shoving here, some pep salt and pepper and some you know tomato sauce in the in the pot. They 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 mixing up. Yep. Yeah. Mm -mm. They're blending some 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 goodness. So with that being said, we're going to react to Jesse's drip in three, two, one, go go. Okay. Yep. I realise that Jessie's boobs are massive by nature. Jessie! Yeah, Jess, Je listen, Jessie is shameless. She does not care. She's like, either you hate it or have you, you love me or you hate me. Yes, Jessie! She can sing, she can rap, she's beautiful. She has a knockish, her ass. Yeah, oh, Jessie, bitch, bitch. I'm here for this. She is taking all the risk. She is so pretty. I envy. I think so many women in Korea want to be Jessie. They want to have that confidence like Jessie. They, I, I imagine even as they talk about being light skin and being pale. I think most women want to be tan skin, sexy like Jessie. Don't tell me these Korean women out here say, no, I want to be pale. I imagine most of these half of Korean women want to be, I want to be like Jessie. Cause all that confidence, the body. How many women want to have like a body like Jessie? These Korean women dreams to have big ass and the big boobies. Is that Jay? Yeah, it is Jay. Mm, Jay. Look at Jay Park. Jesus Christ. Wow. Wow. His blue hair is beautiful. He's such a good looking man. Jesse's ass is so big. <laughs> it's like it's like the combination of a little bit, I, I don't want to mix, I don't want, a little bit like Nicki Minaj, like the boob size, and the ass, like Cardi, Cardi B, like meshed, but it's still Jesse. Look at Jess, Jesse. yes, yes, girl, mm. <laughs> do you boo, she does not care, she's so pretty, I love, Jessie is one of them women that she is powerful, she takes risks, she doesn't give a shit about people talking shite about her. She doesn't, she had no time because she's doing her. Look at that. Yes, Jessie, work it. Jess, I, I, I kind of low-key ship him. I, I kind of low-key ship Jesse and. If you say, no, you're hating, you're jealous. Because I can see potential in couple wise for Jesse and J Park. Don't care what you say. Because they're both, they're both Koreans, but they were born in America. They grew up in America. They both grew up in America. They're just so pretty. That was dripped by Jesse. Jesse! My girl, girl, that was 
booming. That was booming. I like that. I really enjoy that. You can tell they really enjoyed doing these music videos. And she, she took risks. I think this is why she went into P Nation for a reason. We're talking about Sai. Sai who's known for Gangnam Star and Gentleman. And Daddy. Oh my gosh. The, if it wasn't for Sai to sign up Hyuna, to sign up Ida, or no, Dawn, sign up uh, Crush and Jesse, lo and behold, this is the truth here, they will not be taking so many risks. The fact that they're in that, in that company right now is because they're going to take all the risks and it's not going to be some sugar cone. No, it has to be like this. No, 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 not in that one. It's just like, no, no. We can date freely. We can do whatever we want. We can twerk and we can, we can show some, you know, some, some of this. Because Jessie was showing a lot of, Oh, there's a lot of skin showing, but I was like, you know what, you do, you boo. That was great. That was amazing. I love the fact that she has, she's still Korean, but at the same time she is embracing her American side, just like Jay Park. And I, I, I'm glad that they're doing the song together. For those who are hating on Jay Park, sit down, take several seats and just be quiet. And the, the especially the cancel culture. There's no more cancel cancelling culture in this year, in 2020. That that cancelling culture does not exist anymore. It doesn't exist in my book. And and not only just them, also the Sussing fans and the delusional fans that get very upset for support because their faves are dating. You don't you guys don't exist in my book either. So it is a bit of both. I'm very, very, <laughs> I'm very blunt and I'm very going to be transparent. I'm not going to be, yeah, I think you should be like, no, 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 no. They're, they're artists. That's what they do. You, They get paid to perform. That's what they do. They can twerk, they can dance, they can rap, they can swear, they smoke. Obviously, they're going to smoke as a human being. Uh, I'm not fans of smoking. I'm not fans of piercings I'm not fans of tattoos but if they want to do all of that by all means do you boo that's the whole point and uh yeah for those who are the fans those fans who likes to control the idols you don't exist in my book either so get on my face <laughs> I'm so I'm going to gain so much haters right now. <laughs> they go, oh my god, I can't believe you say it. You're so offended. You're so offensive. I, I don't care, really. I really don't care. I'm just going to say what I said. I said what I said. There's a couple people I just don't care about. But I do care. It's just, I'm just going to keep it real and not sugarcoat it. Sugarcoat itsy bitsy just to make people happy. If you don't like me, that's fine. I mean, not that I care, because if it's because I'm saying truths, that's because you hate yourself and you are very, mm. <sighs> yeah. Also, I just found out as well before, speaking of the delusional fans and the sussing fans and the fans that control the idols. Congratulations to Chen! <laughs> Bravo! He's gonna get married. He's gonna be a father. <laughs> boo boo. He's no longer a little child. He's 27. He is old enough. He's, he's gonna get married. I'm so proud of him. I'm so happy for him. And then you got the sad ones. <laughs> the, the, the type of groups, the three groups of fans that are right now tearing and uh, throwing a tantrum right now and crying and stomping and ripping posters right now take several seats because it's, you're mad because you're not it's not you you're mad and jealous because it's not you fam it's only one chain and the girl the lucky the, the lucky girl that is pregnant right now and is going to be the wife of chen welcome to the family of hexo and congratulations congratulations yeah guys be happy for them stop being assholes stop just just stop being childish because you guys are just looking stupid this is why okay this is why we can't have nice things because 
this actually not not us but k-pop idols can't have nice things because fans get mad for no reason chen is no longer a little boy he's not a longer that young boy that once started in sm he is a grown ass man he's nearly 30. he is what 27 8 9 he's by three years he's 30. so therefore chen congratulations i hope all for the best for you and your teacher wife and for the baby we never really know that the exo is going to i think not just exo i think the whole of sm is going to spoil the crap out of the baby he's going to be the center of attention yeah so with that being said i just want to discuss stop being mad stop getting angry stop getting upset guys it's just it's k-pop k-pop idols are human beings if they perform if they twerk if they have less clothes stop being getting stop getting upset I was enjoying the whole thing with Jesse. Jesse was free to explore, free being an artist. That's what artists do. I don't know if if I have to say this very clearly for the, the one who are really thick that do not understand what it means to be an artist. It's not what you want, it's what they want. So that being said, Annyeong everyone and Sarah Hill.